Tonight we begin with our continued flood watch coverage. Governor Steve Bullock declared a flooding emergency for all of Montana earlier today. Much of the state experienced above average snowfall and snowpack over the winter and recent warm weather and rain is starting to release the high elevation snow. The governor's office says the state emergency coordination center has already received numerous declarations of emergencies from local and tribal jurisdictions. The first large floods of the spring began in mid-April when seven north central Montana counties, the Fort Belknap Reservation and the town of Chester saw flooding. Since then, the Clark Fork River has flooded and Missoula neighborhood. The Milk River near Glasgow is flooded and Lewis and Clark County has seen some small stream flooding as well. By issuing this now, the counties won't have to wait on me if they have an emergency declaration. So we want to be fully prepared so that our county and tribal areas can have all the resources they need as we deal with both warming temperatures and the real potential flooding. The governor's order updates a previous order and provides state support for local and tribal jurisdictions in need. It also allows the governor to mobilize the Montana National Guard to protect life, health, and property. Now, Curtis's conversation continues about the flooding and when can we expect some relief? Maybe June next month. Uh, seriously, it's going to be a while before we are out of the woods as far as the flooding goes. And you're going to hear a lot of words, a lot of terminology like aerial flooding and then flood warnings. Let's uh, take a look at the difference between the two via pictures here. A uh, buddy of mine, I uh, will just call it my fly. Big Sky took this picture over Helmville. That is aerial flooding. You can see a uh, widespread across the area. Now a flood warning. This is the Blackfoot River. It's not under a flood warning per se, but if the water came up over the back, Banks like it is doing up on the Milk River, that would be a flood warning. And uh, we continue to see an aerial flood advisory, not a warning, Sealy Lake through Lewis and Clark County and Mark County, and then up in the northeast part of the state, the Milk River continues to flood. But at least uh, the area of the Milk River that's flooding is uh, shrinking here. But uh, a little more like May here over the next few days.